let's learn about wildlife. With a focus on ponds. Do you know the name of this amphibian? It's a newt. Newts have an incredible ability to regrow or regenerate body parts, such as tails, legs and even organs. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a pond skater. Pond skaters are one of the easiest bugs to spot around ponds because they can walk on water. Do you know what these eggs are called? It's frog spawn. Frogs lay their eggs in the water which hatch into tadpoles, then the tadpoles undergo metamorphosis to change into frogs as they reach maturity. Do you know the name of this plant? It's a bulrush. A bulrush is a tall, reed-like water plant with a dark brown, velvety head of numerous tiny flowers. I bet you know the name of this amphibian. It's a frog. Like most amphibians, Frogs can breathe underwater through their skin. A group of frogs together is called an army. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a pond snail. Pond snails that live in water cannot actually swim. Snails can only crawl. Do you know the name of this amphibian? It's a toad. Toads have dry, warty skin and shorter legs than frogs. And when travelling about, toads crawl and frogs move in short jumps. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a dragonfly. Dragonflies are predators and are fierce hunters. Some dragonflies float over the water like hawks looking for prey. Others dart about grabbing prey quickly. They catch insects to eat with their feet. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a water boatman. This brown bug lives in water. It has long hind legs covered in hairs that it uses rather like paddles to swim. Its middle legs are slightly shorter but its front legs are very short and are used to scoop up food. Can you name this plant?
It's a water lily. Water lilies are plants that grow in still or slowly moving water. They like ponds, streams and the edges of lakes in tropical and mild areas. Their floating leaves are often called lily pads. Frogs like to sit on them. I bet you can name these animals. They are tadpoles. Tadpoles hatch from eggs. They have no limbs, only tails to help them swim. It takes about six to nine weeks for tadpoles to become fully grown, though this varies between species. Once they become fully grown tadpoles, they are ready to turn into a froglet. Can you think of any more wildlife that is found near a pond? Give yourselves a well done for super listening. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up to let me know. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button. It really helps my channel to reach new people and you will also keep updated with all my new videos. Thanks, take care, bye for now.